Hello guys, my name is Aftab and welcome to our YouTube channel Tech Beginner and in this video I am going to show you how to install and configure Prometheus with Gafana and uh, we are going to use Ubuntu 18.04 for this demonstration so basically Prometheus is a free and open source time series database which can be used for monitoring purpose so I have already written an article on that so let's start it so in our first step we need to update the ubuntu repository by using this command so here i need to put this command and press enter this command uh, update the ubuntu current repository so we can fetch and install the latest package and after that we need to add the prometheus repository by using this command so just copy and paste here so is added and after that we need to update the ubuntu repository so i'm going to execute again sudo app get update and after that i need to use second command this command will install prometheus and there some required packages like node exporter alert manager push notification just like that so it will take some time to complete we need to wait okay it's done after that we need to verify the prometheus service by using this command which is sudo systemctl status prometheus so we can see that the service is up and running which is good for us let's move ahead on next step so which is ufw rule so let's check ufw is enabled or not in our system so it is inactive that means we don't need to run this one so prometheus by default run on 9090 and uh, i am using aws machine and i have uh, allowed all the traffic so i don't need to do any configuration on this so let's check prometheus with the local host and ip address so let's get the public ip of my machine so this is this is my public ip i need to paste here and type the port number 9090 so here i am able to get the prometheus dashboard so here i can type up and then execute so i'm getting one machine which is my local host machine let's go on another step okay now we need to download the gafana for the visualization of the matrix so let's go temp directory and hit the wget command to download gafana 5.4.3 so it's downloaded and after that we need to install some required packages to use gafana in our ubuntu machine so it is going to install okay and after that we can install the gafana so this is a dev package so that's why we are going to use dpkg command for the same so this installation take few seconds to complete okay it's uh, done and after that we need to see the status of the gafana so service name is gafana hyphen server so i'm going to use system ctl status so by default we are getting this service in a stop condition so we need to enable it so we can get on boot start condition of that service and after that we need to again check this service status it is running or not okay so it's enable and this is status so we can see that 
Grafana is up and running and it is enable on boot. Okay, so by default it is run on port 3000. Let's check out. Okay, so whenever you are going to uh, open UI for the Gafana, so you will get the web page just like that. So by default, your username admin and password admin. And after that, uh, you will get the option to save new password of your Gafana. So on this page, you will get the uh, at the data source. Just click on at data source. So we are using Prometheus. Click on Prometheus as a data source and click here and save localhost colon 9090 where our prometheus is up and running so data source is working fine and after that we need to click on import and then go to website and uh, here is a dashboard id so if we are going to import it so we can get basic system matrix like cpu memory hard disk just like that so just click on load select here prometheus click on import so if everything is going correct so you will get the system utilization matrix just like that cpu memory swap root just like that i hope you will like this video to get more update and get the new technologies installation configuration like mariadb cluster and other things get subscribe my channel Thank you for watching this video.